Yo, what's going on guys? DJS here, CollectiveKicks.com. Wanted to bring you guys an unboxing video, and this one is from Bait. And uh, it was one that ended up dropping the other week, and decided to pull the trigger on it. I, I've historically bought a handful of these ones um, as well, and this is kind of another charity shoe that uh, ends up uh, dropping randomly uh, called the Cruel World. And this is the Cruel World 6, and I have, I think, the 2, 3, maybe 4, or something like that. But um, but this one dropped and I was actually kind of impressed with the way it looked. Not my favorite one out of all of them, but still a really dope one. And so with that being said, let's go ahead and take a look. Hopefully they'll look good in hand. And here we have it. So the, the Crew World 6s. Um, I will say one thing that I didn't prep for this video, and I did so sort of on purpose, is um, what the charity is for. And I'll put a link in the description with more information about this or, or just some description in the in the description, a description in the description, inception, uh, of what these actually uh, represent and why this is the charity shoe uh, for this year. But um, but that's one thing I will say that, that bait could do better. They could include an insert, just like a cardboard insert, like like a retro card size thing of what the charity is and, and what they're donating to when you buy these shoes. Uh, but this is a pair of Saucony's, um, and I definitely wanted to buy this one because uh, historically, again, I've bought some of these ones and I really liked uh, what I ended up getting. You can see it says Saucony and Bait on the back. I love the fact that these ones have the clear soles on the bottoms, as you can see. And then um, I like the, the all black kind of upper and then kind of an interesting looking prints on this one. So different different types of materials. This is kind of a rubberized sort of um, feel to this one, actually, which is interesting. It, looks, it doesn't look rubberized, um, but it kind of feels that way a little bit. And then, um, then you can see it kind of has this interesting uh, nylon sort of material on the upper as well. Uh, mixed in with hits of this this gray speckled uh, crazy design uh, black midsole white midsole and then um, some uh, some speckles on there as well and uh, yeah it's a Saucony bait on the tongue as you can see and uh, let's see what it says on in the tongue sometimes it has a little bit more information on here it does have a little bit of information I can't really read it but it does say cruel uh, world um, initiative and it says Saucony and bait and I definitely support the brand Saucony. Saucony supports uh, me as well. Sends me a lot of cool stuff. And these look like moon um, inspired or outer space inspired. Um, I'm, I'm actually looking forward to seeing what the inspiration truly is. But this is just one of those shoes that like sometimes you, you need like a cool story to have uh, a reason to buy the shoes. Or you see a shoe and you're like, oh, cool. That story for that shoe makes that shoe a little bit better, right? There's other times where um, regardless of the cause, regardless of the story, like you just like the sneaker and this is just one of those shoes i was like damn those those look clean like black silver clear midsoles pretty simplistic um but yet yet kind of complicated or, or complex in a sense with the different types of materials and stuff that you don't normally see on the shadows um i thought that was kind of a cool look so it's definitely one that i wanted to check out and just so you can see it's a shadow 5500 which is different than the shadow 5 5500 instead of the 5000 the 5000 is uh, i have a couple other um models like like the 5000 but so these ones are just a little bit uh different from that but but yeah sometimes you just don't need a story or any backstory to a shoe and you just see a shoe and you really like it because it is uh one that is just appealing uh visually to you so do me a favor leave a comment in the comment section what's the shoe that you guys remember in recent times that you don't care about the hype you don't care about the story you don't care about a limited factor you just like the shoe Leave a comment. Let me know uh, which shoes uh, that is for you guys in recent times. Definitely going to be reading the comment section. Uh, so weigh in and let me know. And uh, and I'll uh, reply back to comments here and there as I usually uh, try to do. But thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And uh, shout out to Bait and Saucony for making a cool collaboration. Glad I copped. And we'll catch you guys for some more videos soon. Peace, guys.